Well, there's a no, uh, an old saying that there is no such thing as a free lunch. I used to hear it from my mm -hmm. dad all the time, but apparently a Valley Group, uh, they haven't heard of that adage, and it's costing restaurants big time. Three on your side's Gary Harper explains. Well, this group is making quite the name for itself, at least in the restaurant industry. Now, the group consists of two adults, three kids, and their dogs. We're not quite sure if the group is an actual family, but we do know this. They're costing Valley restaurants money. The owner and employees at Kawaii Sushi and Asian Cuisine in Peoria say they're pretty good when it comes to customer service. However, they say when this group of customers came in to eat recently, the unexpected happened. The two adults, three children, and their two dogs were greeted by their waitress, Gabriella Weber, who seated them. They came in and they started looking at the menu. The five of them ordered wonton soup, California rolls, salmon rolls, and fried rice. According to the restaurant, the group ate just about everything and racked up a $67 bill. And then when they were almost done eating, they started complaining that the food was not good and that they didn't didn't want to pay or anything like that. Apparently, the adults and three kids claim they didn't like their food and refused to pay the bill. So the restaurant's general manager, Kelly Yu, seen here, stepped in to defuse the problem. As a manager, I go to the table and then adjust that what's the problem, um, how can I fix the problem. Without paying, the group left, but not without one of the kids allegedly yelling out racial slurs at Kelly Yu. It's not just the Chinese that is the racist thing is about the teenagers thing, something like that. Employees snapped a picture of the group's license plate and filed a police report. Kelly then posted the video on social media. And people replied that this group reportedly has a habit of dining and dashing. I saw that um, some other restaurant that did the same thing. Top Shelf Mexican Cantina tells Three in Your Side that the same group, along with their dog, consumed big plates of food. After complaining that they were not satisfied with their meals, the group bolted. China Chili, located in Central Phoenix, says the same thing and tells us the same group tried to pull off the scheme at their restaurant, but the group reluctantly paid after receiving several large entrees to take home for free. As for Kelly, she wants to warn other restaurants and people about this dine and dash caper. We all work so hard. We just want to fair money, we want a business deal like that. It's not we provide food and then you pay for what you owe. That's it. The Peoria Police Department has confirmed that they are investigating and criminal charges are pending. If there's an update, I'll let you know. And by the way, if you're a restaurant and you were hit by this group, we want to hear from you. Just write us an email. I'm Gary Harper, three on your side.